Each year, children from around the world get the surgical help they need at the Hospital for Sick Children here in Toronto because of your generous donations to the Herbie Fund. Tonight, meet twin boys from the Philippines. They're happy and healthy now, but four years ago, it was a far different story. They were isolated, ostracized, lonely, and suffering from a rare medical condition that had them struggling just to breathe. They had croissants, both of them. Their condition meant that their facial bones did not form properly. At school, they get bullied. They get bullied? Uh-huh. Because they don't look normal. Oh, um, they were swimming, and then one of the boys shouted right in front of them. Uh, he told me, oh, I saw a monster. Can I make a turn here, Aaron? Surgery for the twins meant rearranging the bones in their faces. They then were fitted with devices called a halo, which had to be adjusted each day to slowly move the bones into proper position. Don't be laughing at the picture because I'm in it, okay? At first I was hesitant, you yeah. know, because um, putting them, both of them, into surgery is already a risk. Um, I'm just so proud of them because, you know, they're so brave. The family has been fantastic. The kids themselves have been great. And I think the whole team has rallied around to yeah. do the best thing for these, these unfortunate kids who've now got a new lease on life. Three, two, one, go! I'm just so happy for both of them, enjoying the normal life that they both deserve. What a difference the Herbie Fund has made in these boys' lives. It's four years since they had surgery at Sick Kids Hospital in Toronto, and it's like they are different kids. And they're more confident right now. Uh, they're more outgoing, and they have lots of friends right now. I think now. they're more emotionally secure. Yeah. The boys compete on a swim team and have a lot of new friends. Herbie Fund really helped us a lot, and I hope Herbie Fund will be able to help more children from all over the world. To donate, please go to herbiefund.com.